now, let me present the award for Role Player of the Year. A team is made up of athletes who possess many different styles and unique skill sets. United around the pursuit of one goal, each player shares his or her specific character traits for the team's benefit. Whether it be making the clutch play, encouraging their teammates, or bringing hustle when the team needs it most, these athletes are vital to the team's success. The award for Role Player of the Year is presented to a non-starting athlete who inspired their teammates and played a significant role in the success of the team. The nominees for Role Player of the Year are Nathaniel Trumbull, Men's Track and Field. His favorite spot on campus is the library. Very studious, Nathaniel. He says it's a fantastic building and a great place to experience Hope's community in a positive learning environment. Jess Mormon, women's basketball. For her superpower, Jess would like to control time. She thinks it would be very cool to go back in time and relive past experiences. It would be pretty cool. Kevin Hazen, football. For an Olympic sport, Kevin would like to compete in archery. He finds it fascinating how precise the sport is and the level of difficulty behind landing an arrow in a circle smaller than a quarter. It's pretty cool. McKenna Vancouver, women's soccer. She's really good at puzzles and she says she loves making them. I'd like to see one. Adam Bell, men's lacrosse. Uh, his favorite pre-game meal is a tropical smoothie. Sounds good. Uh, Jackson Ewell. Men's Swimming and Diving. Did you know that Jackson knows every president and can wrap them in order? Wrap them in order as of his third grade talent show. Well, Jackson, I have a special request. I'd like for you to make a new rap with all the names of the Hope College presidents and perform that sometime. And now, uh, the 2020 Hopi for Role Player of the Year goes to Jess Mormon, women's basketball. Mormon played a big role off the bench for the Flying Dutchman this year after not playing much during her sophomore season. She always brought positive energy to the team. Mormon was able to play three positions, guard anyone on the floor, and made significant improvements to her offense, which made her a dual threat. Congratulations, Jess. Congratulations, Jess. I first want to thank God for giving me the opportunity to play basketball. Um, I also want to thank my coaches for continuously pushing me and motivating me to work hard day in, day out, and truly do the tough stuff. Um, and finally, I would like to thank my teammates. Without you guys, none of this is possible, and your continuous love and support is the reason that I can do those little things, um, because I know that they won't go unnoticed. So thank you, and go Hope.